Hi everyone, Kristen Roberts with United Way of East Central Iowa. Unfortunately, here in Eastern Iowa, we know that disasters can strike at any moment, whether it's floods, a derecho, we've had more than our fair share. And it's because of this that our hearts go out to the folks in Maui after the August 8th wildfire became the state's deadliest natural catastrophe. The good news, if there's any, is, is that local United Ways are coming together to collaborate for a coordinated response to help the Maui United Way. They're offering staff time, resources, expertise, financial assistance, and it is being put into use immediately. The collective immediate impact has been temporary shelters, food, medical assistance, mental health counseling, being able to provide essential provisions, and also helping folks who have lost identifications or passports in the fires get them back again. And then other areas of our nation, unfortunately, are facing other natural disasters. California, the Southeast, they're seeing recent hurricanes. It's in these times of disaster that I hope you understand that the power of the United Way Network is undeniably strong. We are the trusted resource that you can give to to be able to help support those in need. We experienced it here with our disaster fund back when we had the Drake Show. We had donations come in from every state in the nation and they helped us because of the United Way Network. And we are beyond thankful for that. So back here at home, what are we doing? Well, guess what? September is National Disaster Preparedness Month. And once again, we are co-hosting with the ARC of East Central Iowa, the 9-11 Day of Service. We will continue to prepare for disasters in our own way. And the whole purpose is just so you have that ability to prepare and be ready for whenever the next disaster strikes. So you have an opportunity on Monday, September 11th from two to four, you can join us at the Veterans Memorial Building in downtown Cedar Rapids. You'll be able to hear about disasters and get tips to prepare, and then you'll be able to volunteer. You'll be able to assemble winter survival kits that will be given out to local homeless shelters and food banks and programs for those that serve people with disabilities and older Iowans. We all know that disasters can strike at any moment, and unfortunately that hardship can bring us down. But together we rise up as one united way and one network and one community. Thank you so much for caring about your friends and neighbors. We are so thankful for you. Stay well.